All right, what's up everybody? I'm at it again. I'm, I'm gonna do a little pond fishing uh, right after work, right? It's like 5.30, 5.45, get a couple hours in. I'm gonna hit two, maybe three ponds. Uh, as always, when I'm doing this rush pond fishing, I'm going simple, right? I brought some Senkos in three colors, threw them all in one bag. I brought uh, my, Tex my, my Power Finesse Texas rigged Ned rig. God, try to say that three times fast. Uh, I brought this. That little bait is 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 freaking dope, like Ned rig style, so it gets bit. And I've got quite a few fish, nothing big yet. I brought a uh, a whopper plopper for later if I'm out that late, and I brought my other Celis uh, rigged up with a Texas rig and a four out hook for a worm if I need it. All right, let's fish. Oh, I did get him. <laughs> that was a big old gill that took that. I literally set the hook and flung him. Oh my God. Okay. I just got that gill. That was a good size gill off the log over there. That's probably 20 feet. And I flung him. <laughs> to this log here, like here to there. That was kind of sad and funny. So I might be, I don't know if someone's staying here. It looks like they are. So this will be interesting, kind of awkward. I'm not messing with a thing. I just want to catch a fish. There we go. There we go. Decent. Oh, no, he's, is that not a fish? It is a fish and I'm pulling the whole log in because the fish is hooked up on someone else's line. Oh, and he's off. Yeah, it was like an eight incher that felt giant because I caught this. Oh, what that is someone else's crap and I pulled the whole log in <laughs> this is an interesting day all right so recap so far it has been interesting I hooked that bluegill it was a nice gill I really wanted to get him but I didn't know it was a fish right my line ran I set the hook and I just saw this kind of like greenish colored thing go flying uh, he landed on the bank and then slithered back in the water and then I hooked fishing that log down there in uh, somebody's home, which I think they're gone. I hope they're gone. Uh, fishing that, um, that log, I hooked one, like I absolutely felt it, set the hook, and it was just so heavy, so heavy. And I saw the log, the whole log start moving. And I saw the whole log start moving, but I could see its tail fin moving water. And you saw it, I hooked uh, someone else's Texas rig and that fish, and that fish got off. I got to see him because he was in like six inches of water on the bank there when he swam away. It was little. Okay, I'm going to go flip back in the shady corner, fish some shade on the other side, and then hit a new pond. <laughs> oh my god that was like 
a two inch fish. I think it was a gill. Jesus, this is not my day. There we go. There we go. Like two feet from me. Got one. Still a dink, but uh, <laughs> you know, after flipping a gill, hooking one, losing it, hooking another little gill. I got this guy six feet from me, about three feet from the bank. fish yeah oh there's a fish in there no did I lose him I lied I guess All right, hopped over to the next pond. It's time to go. Like, you know what would absolutely just thrill me? A fish, a single fish over two pounds. Up. A single fish over two pounds right here. Like, I've caught so many damn fish here, never broken two pounds. Come on. That's gonna wrap it. I mean, it wasn't as uh, eventful, I take it back. It was actually pretty eventful, but not in the way that I wanted it to be. I mean, I caught one fish, it was a dink. Uh, hooked the other one, I've told the story. Um, switched pawns and this one was dead. Like, didn't get a bite on the Ned rig. I threw the plopper here as it got lower light, nothing. I didn't see a fish and I normally see a few fish here. So, just dead, you know, it's just one of those days. Yeah, so I'm gonna wrap it, go home, eat some dinner. If you, uh, if you like the videos, you like the adventures, go subscribe. It lets me know I'm doing something good. All right, have a good day.